Welcome back, friends. This is Salomon Jagwe. I'm back with another quick insight. The day is finally here. It's exciting because the Unreal Engine 5.2 has finally been released. And I wonder if that means that uh, the MetaHuman animator is also coming soon. Hopefully, you know, fingers crossed. But uh, there's so many cool things that they've added. And uh, as you can see on this page, they are talking about, uh, you know, procedural content generation framework. Right, I can't wait to see like actually take advantage of this as well. So cool, <laughs> uh, Substrate. That's one of the key you know highlighted features that uh, they've been talking about. And then of course the uh, like this demo that they showed with the Substrate textures on this vehicle. You know, talk about layering, almost like Oppo texture right there. So cool. Uh, enhanced virtual production tools. So guys out there who are cinematographers and virtual production artists, uh, this is going to be awesome. <laughs> you know, so I think for me, the most important, uh, most not important, but most exciting thing is uh, I'm really looking forward to the MetaHuman creator, right? This sample of this duper, super duper character has, has also been uh, made available. So you can get this sample here, download and check it out. But uh, it's uh, taking, I think, the characters and metahumans to another level altogether. It's called the new ML Deformer sample. So check it out. So you can create high fidelity real-time character for PC and consoles with deformations driven by full mass of men. <laughs> So one, other, one thing I don't know if you guys have noticed, but uh, with the metahumans, we don't really get like buff metahumans. So I think this is going to be great to see how we can implement characters, different characters, especially metahumans to make them have that physique that you'd want. Like if you're making a boxer or like a martial artist uh, character like that. So you get the sample right there and you can go to the release notes to see more on how this is uh, going to all look and what is included. But uh, most importantly, Make sure you go to your uh, Unreal Epic Games uh, launcher and update it. The moment I logged in, I saw the little, you know, uh, <laughs> update notification over there and updated. So now I'm looking forward to all the plugins that we've been looking for. So I, when I look at installed plugins, I only have quick sub bridge, right? But when I go to 5.1, then you can see all these right here. So I'm looking forward to see if the MetaHuman plugin has also been updated. Uh, because so far I don't see I don't have it installed just yet. So now that this is official, I'm looking forward to all the other plugins becoming you know released being released as official plugins as well. Because there was a time when I was using this and we had all oh, <laughs> a much longer list. And there are some companies that I mean some of them are not compatible with 5.2 at all. But we I'm hoping that this list will be reflected here as well. Like right now, I don't have the same number of plugins as I have here. So I'm looking forward to all the other companies that create these plugins to be able to update it so we can definitely take advantage of all the core things that uh, they've added. But when you get a chance, uh, do check it out and let me know what you think. It's really, really awesome. This is a, one of the one core feature that I'm looking forward to testing as well. So, and they have a video here showing the different uh, features. So check it out and let me know what you think. Are you guys excited? You know, how many of you are super duper and like apt up about the meta human uh, animator? And uh, hopefully this, they said it was going to come in in uh, two months in the summer. So you know what? Let me actually see if it's available. Let's go to F11. I'm going to go to the meta human creator. Let me see if it's actually available. Let's go to the MetaHuman Creator and uh, and see what if there's anything different about it. Because you know, any time that they announce a new feature in uh, whenever they announce a new version of the MetaHuman, uh, like of the Unreal Engine, they usually the MetaHumans get a slight update. So let's see if there's anything new in the MetaHuman Creator because I'm looking forward, <laughs> I'm really, really looking forward to the MetaHuman Animator. And they did tell us it was in a, I think they said a couple of months, but I don't know if it's uh, in June, July, it was about two months ago now when they first announced uh, the Unreal Engine 5.2. Uh, it went through Preview 1 and then Preview 2, and now it's finally here. So let's see if there's anything different about the MetaHuman Creator. In the meantime, you can see the video here showing some of the virtual production updates uh, that they've introduced. So neat. 
it's amazing how the industry is changing, you know, like being able to, this, there are some things that have improved so greatly that we didn't have before in like 4.27, even 5.0. To see them finally coming in 5.2 is exciting. Thank you so much, Epic Games team. Uh, you guys, I know you've been working hard on it. So let's see. Is there anything different? Uh, let's go ahead and uh, edit this selected. Mm, do I want to edit that one? Let's try this one. And let's give it a second over there. Let's go to full screen. Or let's go ahead and uh, click on uh, edit selected. Uh, is there anything new over here? Anything new in the shoes? Not really. In bottoms, no. In tops, nah. Proportions, still the same. Beard, still the same. Mustaches, eyebrows. Yeah, makeup, teeth, eyes, skin, plain, custom mesh. So all this is still the same. So I don't see anything new in the MetaHuman uh, creator. So let's go back to over here. And uh, let me see if the MetaHuman plugin is available for 5.2. So we're just going to do Meta human so this one is not yet available uh, for 5.2 either so all we have so far are these updates get out of full screen uh, these updates that are, they've announced today but uh, I don't see Meta human animator. <laughs> I was so looking forward to that. Okay, looks like we may be waiting for a little bit. Maybe hopefully it's around the corner. Uh, we'll see. But again, I think this is cool. This I'm definitely gonna try it out. I'm gonna go. Let's see if I click on. Sorry, too quick. Let's go to get the sample and see what it looks like. So you can see it's just for five point two, and just uh, add it to the cut, and go ahead and check it, check out. Oh, we're, un we're unable to resolve it. This miss. What just happened? Okay. All right, guys. So if you're able to download this, let me know. Because it seems like I refreshed. Check out. Okay. So I don't have it just yet. <laughs> so I'll check it out once it uh, becomes available and uh, share my thoughts about it. But it looks really, really good. As deformations are they look amazing all right thank you so much guys for joining me today uh again we're talking about the release of uh the unreal engine 5.2 being official and you can find it in your library over here in the epic games launcher and just install it and have fun with it and see you next time here with an, in another video and as always dare to dream big never give up on your dream guys and stay safe much love to you all